Hello everyone. I don't know if you know where I am, but I'm out by, let me turn the camera around so you can see it. Um, hold on, I'll see if I can do that while I'm online, but I might have something interesting to show you. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how to turn it around, so I'm just going to look, turn it around now, see if you can see where I am. I'm going to turn it down again, a bit lower. Well, right, well, I'm on a bit of an adventure because today I was just watering my plants with the watering can, you know, the ones that you use, and I was just about to pour out the water when I noticed in my watering can was some frog spawn. Well, frog spawn is like baby frog's eggs. So that was a bit of a surprise. So I've just brought them out to the little pond down the road next to the brick pit lake. Um, I don't know if you can see behind me. There's the brick pit lake behind me. You might have walked here with daddy a few times. I'll show you in a minute. But I just wanted to show you, I don't know if you'll be able to see it very clearly, but I've just put the frog spawn into this pond and I'll see if I can see where the frog is. She should be somewhere close by, but if not, hmm, I can't see her now because she's got good camouflage, but I'll turn the phone upside down to see if you can see what I've just put in the water here. Hold on. It might be a bit dark at this time of day, but I didn't want to wait till any later, just in case it all went pear-shaped. So I've, I'll just show you now in the water. I don't know if you can see just there ahead where my finger is, is some blobs of grey frog spawn with little black dots inside you might have to zoom in a bit more and there's some more over there I don't know if that's any better it's, it's difficult to see with my own eyes but they were in that the black dots hang on the black dots are the tadpoles and they're still in their frog spawn at the moment and I'm trying to look at where the frog went but I can't see her at the moment but she's in here with them she'll be looking after them for the next few weeks while they grow into little baby frogs and then they've got this whole pond here to play in which is can you see it goes quite a long way it's quite a big pond And it'll be much better than playing in my watering can, won't it? Well, anyway, I'm just about to head back so that I can read you a bedtime story. But I thought I'd post this video first so that you can see what I'm doing. And uh, hopefully that won't happen again, because I didn't fancy having a frog or several hundred frogs hopping around my shed. So um, I'll just take you now if I can pick up two watering cans. I brought one with some extra water just in case I needed to have some. Hang on, I might just, oh, I'm stuck in the bramble. I'll just wash out the, I'll just wash out the um, watering can just in case there's any spare frog spawn lurking in it. I, I want them all to have a happy life and uh, so on we go and I'll just show you oh, let's get rid of that water there I don't need to carry that around with me I must have looked a funny sight carrying two watering cans down my street but here we go oh, it's a nice oh, got stuck in some brambles there right let me turn the phone look at this beautiful sunset and this beautiful lake. Hold on, I'll turn the phone round. 
can you see doesn't that look beautiful there it's all peaceful and serene and I think all the birds are heading to bed soon but it's really lovely there there's one plane in the distance and I don't know if you can see it somewhere up there a little white dot in the sky oh look two birds flying overhead and everything's quietening down for the evening so I'll finish this video now and then find my way back home without the frogs speak to you later for a bedtime story night night